Hey, I want to share with you how to make an intuitive decision. But first, I'm going to give you an example. So a friend of mine asked me if I would like to come to a paint night. And it was going to be a spiritual paint night with meditation and just like the most gorgeous art and obviously very beautiful, wonderful people. That sounds exciting. That sounds awesome. But something didn't sit right with me. I paid attention to my body and my body was giving me a sign like that doesn't feel right don't go like just don't it's not right so I told my friend I'm gonna sit this one out for some reason it's not sitting well with me I just am not meant to go to this one turns out that day I ended up getting my girly time having the worst cramps ever having a terrible day where everything went wrong and there's just no way I would have been in a good headspace to go to that and I would have probably been bringing the vibration down for everyone else. So if you listen to your body, you'll have like initial react reactions a lot of the time when you start using your intuition more and your body will give you a sign, whether it's in your heart or your stomach or wherever, your head, you should feel something and know whether it's right for you. Now I'm gonna tell you another way you can train yourself to use your intuition. So in a book I was reading, it talked about the flipping a coin method. You know how everyone likes to grab a quarter and flip it for a decision, like choose heads or tails and tie that to one of the choices. So the real thing about that scenario is it's not actually about the coin choosing it for you. It's when you, pick heads and you tie that with a decision and then you you put the coin on your hand and you check it out and you're like heads you're either gonna feel like yes that's what I wanted or no flip again flip again um, so that right there is your instant reaction the minute you see the coin after you flipped it you're gonna have a reaction to the the choice that was made if you're passive and you're like okay I'll do that then I guess Either decision really didn't matter to you, but you will have some sort of reaction. So pay attention to that because that is your intuition. Now, my daughter often, she'll ask questions and she wants me to make a choice for her. It'll be like, mom, should I wear this today or should I wear that? I don't have to flip a coin. I just, without giving it any thought at all, just spit out an answer for her and then pay attention to her reaction. And she's like, no, and I'm like, well, there you go. You have your answer now. You know what you want to do. But it's not until you take the answer away and let something else decide and then have a reaction that you know.